Hey guys, it's MJ and Izzy from Endless RVing. Today is a beautiful day in Tampa, Florida. We're here at RV1 and we are just about three or so days away from the start of the Tampa RV show. Yep. It kicks off on Wednesday. Super excited. We are so excited. So what we're gonna do today for you is to give you top secret information to make sure that if you are shopping for an RV, you are going to get the best deal possible. Also, make sure to stay to the end. We've got a couple tips for you, but also really, really important information that we don't want you to miss at the end of this video. So if you're looking to purchase an RV, number one is really, really important. And if you're getting an RV, a car, whatever, there, you know there's always fees and a lot of them are going to be hidden fees right they could be like the pdi charge or document charge you know document fee or you know wash your floor free whatever they they have all kind of crazy fees but listen every dealership is going to have some kind of fee it's going to be on there on the contract what really really matters is your out the door price right mm -hmm. so for example if you have you know we have a north point behind us say that's priced at seventy five thousand dollars i'm just throwing that out there Seventy-five thousand uh, dollars. It's priced here at RV One, for example. Uh, but General RV has it priced for seventy-three five, right? Like that's the price. But then out the door at General RV, it's seventy-nine thousand, mm -hmm. and this is seventy-six five. Well, what's the better deal, right? right. The one that's seventy-six five. Also, another thing we talk about trade-ins, mm -hmm. and we experienced this when we bought our RV. A lot of things that dealerships will do, they'll offer you a really high trade, but then they don't discount the RV as much. Right. Again, the dealerships are trying to make as much money as possible. You're trying to save as much money as possible. So it may be if a, a, a trade-in is a little less, but you're getting a better deal going out the door, or maybe even if you sell that your trade on, on, your, on your own, own which right. is what we did, and we made a lot more money, you could be getting a better deal that way. So See, remember, right. out the door is mm -hmm. all that matters. All right, so continuing on some really important stuff, we're gonna talk about financing. A lot of times you're going to be financing RVs if they're a higher cost RV, mm -hmm. unless you're paying cash, which is always a good thing. But just keep in mind, financing doesn't have to be done through that dealership, right? right? They, if they offer you the best price, so be it. But you can bring your financing if you want through your credit union or your bank or you want to shop around. You can do that. Just remember that can also kind of... Uh, they could also count to the out the door price, right? Like a 5% versus a 3.99, that's a big difference. So keep right. that in mind. Right, number two a tip for you is to shop dealerships against each other, right? Now, at, the, at these RV shows, you usually have this, the dealerships are representing certain manufacturers. So for example, General RV may be representing Fleetwood, Holiday Rambler, okay? That doesn't mean that you can't go and get a Fleetwood Holiday Rambler from RV1 or Campers Inn or, or somewhere else. Correct. Shop them against each other. And we did this when we bought our motorhome, yeah. right? We, there was, well, RV1 was representing Newmar, but there were other dealerships at that show that were giving us prices. And we shopped them mm -hmm. all again and say, hey, listen, they're doing this and they're doing right. this. You can do that. Certainly just understand that yes, multiple dealerships, they do carry multiple brands outside of the RV show. Right, and you just really have to be your own advocate. All right, so the final thing, really exciting, we're having a number of meetups this week at the RV show. So if you're going to be there and you haven't seen our schedule, we've posted it a little bit. Um, we are going to be Thursday from 1.30 to 3 p.m. at the Liquid Spring booth, which is A37. Mm -hmm. And then on Friday, we'll be at Matt's RV Reviews tent from 1 to 3 p.m. And then on for Saturday. Saturday, sorry, yep. <laughs> Saturday, we're gonna be back at the Liquid Spring booth from 1.30 to 3 p.m. Uh, booth A37. Now the cool thing about these is we have some amazing giveaways Thursday and Saturday guys. At the Liquid Spring booth we will have giveaways. Yes, now they're limited but we have a lot. We have a decent yep. amount of all, di all different things. We're not going to tell you what they are though. But you definitely want to you know, uh, stop by, say hi. We really look forward to meeting you and let us give you something. And then the other important thing if you obviously you know we work with Liquid Spring. We have a discount code mm -hmm. ride endlessly $750 off a new Liquid Spring suspension system however that ends at the show we've said this under the videos we don't want you to miss it if you're serious about getting a liquid spring system you're going to want to test drive it there of course but you're going to want to if, if you're serious you have to leave your deposit at the yeah. show because you're going to lose that 750 dollars right so that was a lot of info for you guys but we're happy to be at the show if you see us say hi we're going to be out and about 
really uh, Tuesday through Saturday. Mm -hmm. We'll be there. Mm -hmm. Say hi, and uh, we'll see everybody at the show.